Yo, 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 what's good, what's good? For the people who don't know what's going on, bro, go ahead, introduce yourself. Why is it Barrio, man? What's going on? Yeah. Two Four Global. Yeah, Two yeah, four yeah. Records. Nah, shit, it ain't your la first time on this bitch, you know what? Well, damn, it ain't your first time on the channel. You know what I'm saying? So we gonna go down through there. What you what you got going right now? You really going crazy, bro. Like, you dropping music. You know what I'm saying? You dropping videos. You in the clubs. Yeah. I seen you in Houston turned up. Mm -hmm. What's what's new? New buddy, uh, new music, new mindset. Uh, 2023, I just been telling me my people, we trying to change the tax bracket. So, shit, just different type of hustle this year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, shit, bro, like, what, what you think the climate is in the in the Dallas music scene right now? It's hot and rising. It's hot. We got some, like, young talent, young hot talent. Oh, God, for sure, on the rise. Just we need to be, you know what I'm saying? Expedited. All right, what you mean by that? Like, it need to be, like, like what I mean, like it just need to be putting more people face. I feel like it's not a like, you know what I'm saying? It ain't enough. It ain't putting. It ain't enough. You know what I'm saying? Wait to Dallas right now, but mm. I'm saying I, I don't know shit. Why you feel like that? Because I feel like the niggas in position. You know what I'm saying? They ain't really just pushing what we got going type shit. I don't know. I just you say like you it. feel like the city ain't really embracing the talent we got here. Yeah. Like, How can we do that more in your opinion? The niggas that's in position, they gotta, you know what I'm saying? Use that, use that, you know what I'm saying? The DJs, the right, bloggers. Now, I be putting, I, the, I put, I put this out a lot that Dallas DJs don't really support the local like, artists here. How accurate would you say that is? Nah, Dallas DJ, you good? Dallas DJs don't support local artists because, like, you know what I'm saying? Not for free, shit. Nigga gotta go pay them for sure. Like everywhere I go, I pay the DJs. So like, you know what I'm saying? They, they, they I feel like they don't tap into artists out here at all, for sure. Especially so, not upcoming artists. So like, nigga like, gotta be, gotta have a name for sure to get some play in a club out here in their own city, for sure, for sure. Like, so I playing. mean, so like, okay, so like, if you pay, you it's just like pay, play, probably not go that's play it. again until you pay. That's it. Pay, play, that's it. These niggas like. I feel like niggas like, I feel like niggas in it, like bro said, like, Razia made a good point when he came out here. Niggas more in it for the money than the relationships type shit. You know mm. what I'm saying? But most, most niggas that's, 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 that's in the tax bracket that niggas want to be in, you know what I'm saying? They talk more about relationships to get where they at type, type vibe. So it's like, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Now, now, uh, you ain't lying, bro. Yeah, that's that's real. Now, do you feel like how can we get to that point if you could say like, dude, dude, is it not? Do do you feel like artists have that advantage to tap in with a DJ? Like, are you going out besides to the to this nigga club? Are you popping out early? Like, hey, bro, I rap. I got a single that's going on. You know what I'm saying? T tap in, check me out. I feel like I feel like niggas don't I feel like niggas don't do that as as much as they should, but it's cause like it's more of a war thing than niggas getting together. You know what I'm saying? Like it shouldn't be, it shouldn't, it shouldn't feel like that. Like me personally, like I shouldn't feel like if I go to this DJ and tell him that and do this and do this and do this, he still gonna play another nigga music from another city more than he play my shit. Like he just gonna trash what I'm telling him, you know what I'm saying? If it ain't if a nigga ain't talking about no money type shit. That's why, like, I feel like niggas out here, like, that's why I respect my era so much, because niggas really get into it, like, 90% of these niggas be independent, you know what I'm saying, putting in their own work, paying DJs, paying for their own videos, paying for their own studio time, you know what I'm saying, so it's just like... So it ain't really like no big dogs in Dallas that's getting behind artists and hell putting nah. the bread up in. Hell no, nah. hell no, nah. we, don't, we don't got nothing like that out here. The big dogs want to be, the, the big dogs, shit... They feel like shit is they time, shit. <laughs> they want to be the big guys, rappers? shit. Yeah, they want to be rappers, shit. Damn. All niggas want to be rappers. Right. But I ain't going to hate, though. It's some, it's some older niggas that's talented, though. Like, they really, you know what I'm saying? They really pop yeah. that shit. But. So why you think there's no OGs out here that's really, like, you know, trying to tap in with the youngsters, if you could say? They want to be us. Pop my shit. Why I say Mario? <laughs> what you mean? Old niggas want to be us. Like, they want to live like young niggas or what? Yeah. Old nigga, older niggas in the club, they in beefs. Ain't no OGs out here to just tell a nigga like, like, you know what I'm saying? If niggas into it, ain't no OG to come bring this shit together, just settle this shit. You know what I'm saying? It's young niggas, young nigga world. It's, it's fucked up. Is young niggas listen to these older niggas though? Nah, hell, nah, not out here. 
So, what yeah. you mean? Like, so do you feel like niggas ain't gonna listen anyway if a nigga do try to step in or what? You, what you what you say? Is, you said, he, is they listening to the yeah, other niggas? Yeah. Nah, the older niggas ain't giving the game like that. That's what I'm saying. Like, it's not no OGs that just, you know what I'm saying, stepped in point to just come out here and just, nah, hell nah. It's young nigga world. But I ain't saying it like on some shit like that, like a nigga just won't hurt. Won't, you know what I'm saying? Dude, it's just know. nobody out here making, putting their foot forward to yeah, basically bring some stuff shit. together. Yeah. Now, uh, if you could say, like, if, if you could say, like, one thing you wish that we did have here in Dallas, what would you say it is? Foundation, structure, like, uh, uh, what's this shit called? Like, a, you know what I'm saying? A triangle? Nah, not a triangle. <laughs> <laughs> High as fuck. I don't know. I just feel like it's a, it's a, it's a structure, or a way to do shit type shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, this nigga go here, go to these studios, come out of this building, come out of this camp. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It's not no structure. Yeah, like nah, said, bro. I went to, I went to Phoenix. one on one fiend for yourself out here. For sure, for sure, I agree. For sure. I went to Phoenix, bro, and I was talking to a cameraman. He was like, yeah, our rappers, we got a structure. Like, it's actually, like, steps to getting on here. Like, yeah. you go through these steps, now you own. Yeah. It's as not it that in Dallas. Yeah, as it should be. But not saying some niggas can't pop overnight, but it's just like, yeah, it's just, we don't got that out here. Okay, okay. Now, you you been rapping for a minute. Like, I yeah. can honestly say you've been out here about five, six years yeah. rapping. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, so, do you feel like right now you, you the best you ever been? Nope. Mm, okay. Nah, hell nah. I ain't. Uh, hell nah. Still got work to do. Type shit. I ain't put in enough work. Shit. I ain't. I ain't where I need to be. Shit. I ain't where I can kick my feet up. I still yeah. gotta go out here and put in work every day. Yeah. So shit. Hell nah. Hell nah. I ain't where I wanna be. I ain't where I ain't. I ain't, I ain't the best I am. I ain't the mm -hmm. best me right now. Shit. I'm. I'm hot. I'm going. I'm, I'm handling business. But shit. Hell nah. I still got work to do. Okay. Okay. Now, what's some of your goals, bro? Like, because like I say, like I see you. I ain't gonna lie, like right now I see you probably the most active ever. Like constantly dropping video, you drop a new video every month, you dropping projects, you got singles, you getting features, you know uh -huh. what I'm saying? Like right now you 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 working, so what what you think you gotta do next? I feel like I feel like well like I said this year, I feel like I am gonna focus more on like, you know what I'm saying, singles, like just putting out more singles, get more features, but it's more on the it's more on the tip like like I feel like I just need to, you know what I'm saying, put more promotion behind this shit, like, you know what I'm saying, yeah. but, it's, but it's hard because I'm an independent artist, so at the same time, I'm still doing independent artist shit, so, you know what I'm saying, it's just, shit, nigga gotta still get it out the mud, still, you know what I'm saying, pay for this, pay for this, pay for videos, pay for clothes, pay for video shoes, pay for studio time, you know what I'm saying, at the same time, pay for promotion, because shit, nigga pay for promotion, you know what I'm saying, you gotta yeah. do that shit. Nah, for sure, for sure, nah, shit, you, you talked a little bit off camera about Gutter TV made a, uh, uh, a statement saying like artists be turning down deals like mm -hmm. what's a what's a deal that you would take right now like if, if it was a deal on the table like what would be your perfect deal a perfect deal for me is like i just feel like for me it ain't really about the money because the money situation gonna get handled regardless you know what i'm saying it's more about like it's more about i want to the, the, the perfect deal for me would be more like putting my money into the music not saying like a nigga ain't gonna take no paper because like that's common sense but it's more like put my money into the music type shit so i ain't gonna just put no number on it but like you know what i'm saying i want i want to put my paper into the promotion or get me there to where i can get to that next deal you know what i'm saying and be able to have the leverage to stretch my nuts so you know what i'm saying coming there with that confidence to where i, I need this now instead of what you want type shit like what we can give you you know what i'm saying niggas asking me what i want type right shit. right 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 so you really just want a solid team that's go you know do your marketing Promoting, exactly. Put that's you in the places where you're at right now. Yeah. More, right. more of a marketing deal than a money type deal. Shit. All right, for sure, for sure. Now, shit, bro. Uh, rest in peace, Wody. Two live. You know, his birthday just passed the other day. His birthday was yesterday. Yeah. I live my nigga Wody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, for the people who don't know, bro, tell them your relationship with Wody and what he meant to the DFW scene. That was my brother, but like, you know how they say, blood make you closer than, you know what I'm saying? Like, what they say? On you know, some hot shit. Uh, blood don't, blood don't make you closer, some shit like that. That was my yeah. brother though. Different moments, but that was my brother for shit show. Like, shit, we did everything together. That was my left hand, shit. Yeah, yeah, now shit. The, initially, the first time he, uh, the first time he was shot, I think y'all was together. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like. So, 
I don't know about the the second situation. Was y'all t- was you together when he found out he passed? Uh. Uh-uh. He was uh. It wasn't with nobody. He was with nobody. He be with every day. Okay. So you know what I'm saying? Like just get the gun, get that. He wasn't with nobody. He be with every day. So that's why the situation was weird. But you know what I'm saying? It's just shit. Hell nah, I was I was in the bed shit when I got the car. It was like three in the morning. Yeah, not shot. I fucked up and he was re- literally like walking distance. He was at the hospital walking distance from me. Some shit, yeah. Damn, walking distance from where you was at? Yeah, where I stayed at the point at, at, back then. Yeah. Damn. He, he went to the hospital walking distance from where I stayed. But I drove still, but I'm I'm just saying I could have walked type yeah, shit. Like, damn. On damn. the maps that was like a 15, 14 minute walk. That ain't shit, you know what I'm saying? Drive, that's like six <laughs> minutes. Right, 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 right. Now shit, bro, like like how did that affect you and you know what I'm saying? Like is is that still like hey, is that a big uh, push for you? Hey yeah, that nigga lived through me, bro. I gotta tell you people that nigga lived through me, bro. That was my real life brother, like fuck like like the older we got, like that was my brother, like we grew together, like so like we'll come in this hole and like instead of recording, like a nigga would just gossip me talk for like, you know what I'm saying, talk about what we got going or what we going through or what what we did today for like five hours, you know what I'm saying? Like Get studio time for four, five hours, but one day make a song, like fuck around the whole time type shit. Like that shit just, you know what I'm saying? For a whole, for a minute, a nigga didn't want to do this shit, but like I said, bro, the biggest push I got is my people. So like my people kept pushing me to do this shit and shit. Like yeah. I said, he just pushed through me. So and it's like out of two folk, bro. I think you are the only one free, huh? You only one nigga free right now? Nah, right? hell nah, my nigga Dollar, Dollar free. Okay, okay. Yeah, then my people, but like rapping. I'm saying wise, rapping wise. Yeah, hey, yeah, duh. yeah, free guys. Yeah, no, nah, for sure, for sure. Now, did that motivate you too, bro? Because it's like, like I say, I watch y'all as kids, you know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas all together, and then now it's like, I see you pushing though, like still yeah. going hard with the shit. You know what I'm saying? A, it's, a, it's a good and a bad to it, but like you said, I use it as motivation though, like, well, it ain't no good to it at all, but I use, the, I use the bad to make it good to where it's motivation, you know what I'm saying? Like, Fucked up, it's just fucked up situation, you know what I'm saying? Where I had my two, you know what I'm saying? The body left me, and then I had my two, my two niggas that I be with every day leave me too, you know what I'm saying? So it's fucked up, but for the guys, I just use it as motivation though. For sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. For sure. And I said, bro, if you could say, well, every time I post you, I say your music, Jug music. Uh huh. <laughs> That's what it is. So, like. That's the category. Okay, okay. Do you think. Like, money making music, money on music, money on. That's the new shit. Yeah. Yeah, if you had to put yourself up there like top jug rappers in Texas, where you at? I'm a one. Nobody talking that shit like you. Wody. Wody number one. One A and then Y S N Barrio, Y B. One right. B. Who else be talking that shit to you? Jugging? Yeah. In the city? Period. In Texas. In Texas? Jugging wise. Kevin, Kevin I man. give it to Kevin. All right. Cause I see he, I see he, I see he, I see he rap with, he, I see where he, I see he rap with, he be, you know what I'm saying? What he be talking about, he, he, you know what I'm saying? He be handling his business on the jug side, so I get it. I give Miss Flowers for that. But on the jug side, my my age group, just in Texas, bro. Like whoever, what's what's your boy name? I fuck with him too. Uh, oh hell yeah, I'm tripping. Uh, BTB Savage. Yeah yeah. BTB yeah, yeah. Savage, that's my dog. Hell yeah, run me through there. Keep me, give me some more names. Uh, shit, I right, him. Shit, cause I can't think. Uh, you, Kevin got bands. I like I really... how you said me too. <laughs> you said me. Yeah yeah. Not yeah, me. Nah. You said me. For sure, for sure. Mm-hmm. Uh. It's it's a few niggas be talking some shit, bro. It's Who? If I if I miss them. Who? I don't know right exactly, now. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Right exactly, that's what I'm saying. This is I don't know. This is, yeah. It's a few niggas, so you in your own lane for sure. Now anybody else outside of this hole that you be listening to? And I listen and that outside of Dallas? Outside of Texas. Outside of Texas? Yeah. No. Okay. Like uh, big rappers and shit, but like nah, hell nah. I don't even I don't pay attention to other niggas outside of Texas. I listen to a lot of rappers in Texas. Okay, okay. Shit, so. For sure. A lot of my, you know what I'm saying? I get a lot of niggas out here, they flowers, because I feel like don't nobody come harder than us. Damn, so you feel like Texas got the hardest rappers? I mean, like, come on, of course, Atlanta and shit. Like, I'm talking about, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, underground, big, you know, coming up rappers. I ain't talking about, like. Yeah. Uh-huh. Texas got the hardest underground rappers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I don't listen to niggas. That's why I, fuck. That's why I need you to put me on shit. But yeah. yeah. We yeah. the toughest. Nah, for sure. We got sure. some shit out here. Man, niggas be having some shit though, I ain't gonna lie. Niggas be having some shit better than us? The Texas? Yeah. Yeah, bro. Underground better than us? Yes. 
Nigga, it's cause you. Nigga. It's cause you get a lot of sorry shit. Nah, but out of, out of the hardest shit, out of the hardest niggas, niggas out here, going hard, bro. Like Dallas, I ain't gonna lie, they got some niggas. It's a few niggas, bro. But so there's niggas in other cities fucking with me underground. Underground niggas. I can I can hang with any. Rapping about different shit. I can hang with any yeah. nigga underground. I can hang. Can I hang? Can yeah. I hang? Yeah. Nah, your shit good though. You ain't like can a regular. Can Montana Seven Hundred hang with any nigga around? He, in other he, cities. He can pop shit with niggas. Yeah. Can BK, but what's his name? K K K. No, nah, I ain't gonna count BK Beasy there. He he added it. Right. What's uh? What's my boy K Baby? Stop it, bro. I ain't gonna lie. That's different though. I ain't gonna lie. He in the lane by himself, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He kind of like he like TikTok rap, real rap. He all around the board with it. It's like he in the that shit going. Yeah, he, yeah, I, I think time. he a little bit bigger than underground for yeah, real. Nah, for real, I get it to him, yeah. I think he a little bit bigger than underground, but shit, like, it's, it's like, I just feel like it's the scene, too, though, that yeah. that, that don't help y'all. Yeah, for sure. Because other niggas got scenes that the, everybody go exactly. embracing. That's what I'm saying. Like, like, like rappers are here doing, like, toy drives and and giving back to niggas. I want to get into that, though, just because, like, not even to... To, to to raise my name just cause you know or, or boost my boost my boost what I got going on, but I just want to get into that shit cause shit I like giving back shit. My but, sure. but I feel like that's what uh, is missing here too though. It mm -hmm. ain't no opportunities for niggas to do that though. Nah, like, for real. Wait, you don't see no businesses messing with the local rappers for real. They don't show love out here, bro. But shit, that's why we gotta. You know what I'm saying that's why a nigga gotta come at this bitch and step foot in, but. That shit need to change though, for sure, for sure. Like, do you feel like it's a big divide between Fort Worth and Dallas? Big said, divide? Yeah. Hell yeah. What's that? What's the why? 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 Why you think that is? Fort Worth, just, bro. My pop, I got a day one partner. Like my nigga Kenny B. I be with him every other weekend. That's my nigga. Like it's just we different niggas. Like we just two. He from Fort Worth. I'm from Dallas. Like we just two different type of percent. Like we just two different type of niggas. Like yeah. Like it's just different niggas. Like say like, walk different. They talk different. They dress different. They move different. Shit. <laughs> yeah. They cool though, but shit. It's just a difference. Yeah. So you different. feel like it should be more unity between the Fort Worth and Dallas on the music side. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. It should. What be, scene you think litter? Fort Worth or Dallas? Fort Worth. Why? Because they more, Fort Worth more messy, bro. Fort Worth got a lot of messy shit going on. Niggas getting into it. Be, the beef shit, the beef shit is where, the beef shit is where it's fucked up, but the beef shit where it's at. So, you know what I'm saying? Niggas, niggas that you never heard of could drop a song saying, I'm smoking him out there and shit. That shit'll go. Yeah. It's fucked up. That shit'll go. That shit'll get 10, 20,000 views. And the nigga ain't be talking about nothing but smoking whoever and shit. And that shit going. But out here in the Dallas, out here in Dallas, you don't really hear a lot of niggas like, just on that type of tip out here. Like, we, you know what I'm saying? We might get money for this type yeah. niggas out here. Damn, for sure. You got a point. Yeah, nah, for real. <laughs> you got a point. Nah, for hey, real. why you think that is, though? Shit, for a worth a way smaller city. Yeah. Oh, God. Like, you can be in a, you can be, you could be, a, you could be here in Fort Worth in the, in the suburbs, and then ten minutes you in fucking well uh, stop six. It's just like shit for Worth, smaller city, so it's just like shit. They, they got more shit. You know what I'm saying? We don't see each other that much like that. So a Dallas nigga could not see. Only way you gonna see a nigga that you got to it with is it, it out somewhere out here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You could go pull up on a nigga blocking for work, or a nigga store, or where a nigga be, and it, it be that, or you know what I'm saying? A studio up the street, or it be that, or. You know what I'm saying? Gas station. I hear shit. It's just, you know what I'm saying? Nah, for sure, for sure. Now, shit, if you got to say, bro, we like. We carry ourselves different, though. Yeah, that's a fact. Yeah. That's a fact. That's, that's a fact. That's niggas carry themselves different. Do you feel like it's enough older rappers, like niggas that's been in the game, reaching back to the young niggas? Nah. Hell nah, hell nah. But I get Freddie his flowers, though, because Freddie, Freddie, Freddie do that shit. Freddie yeah. do that shit for sure. But as for, like, Shit, I can't get nobody else they flowers type shit. Damn, so like the the rose. What about the Young Ro Nation? Young Nation, Young back. Nation, hell yeah, Young, Young Nation, hell yeah, back. fuck yeah, Young Nation, I can get they flowers. The row, shit, who the row, who, who the row, who the row shows some love to? Young Nation. Yeah. Shit, I guess, but you know what I'm saying? Hell nah, it's just that's about it. Hell nah, you know, they they just I don't know. I think they be feeling entitled though, like a nigga supposed to respect them or supposed to, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But like, so let me yeah. ask you this, bro. When Don Chief came back out, like. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying like, damn, he was supposed to be this, this, and that. Do you feel like he was one of the ones that should, like niggas should have been jumping on the wave for real? I ain't, I ain't gonna even cap, bro. Like I, I, I like he was cool and shit. I, I tapped into a lot of his interviews. I tapped into a lot of niggas' interviews, but I ain't never heard Don Chief. Keep, uh, what his name? Don, Don Chief. Chief. I ain't never heard Don Chief song. Damn. I ain't never heard. And where Don you Chief from? Song. I'm from Duncanville. And you ain't never heard Don Chief. Never heard Don Chief song. How old are you? I'm 23. 
Damn. All right. I ain't never heard of Dunk Chief. But you tapped into the interview. I tapped into him though. Like I, I fuck with, I fuck with how he move. On guy, I ain't never heard of Dunk Chief song. So I like on some respectful shit though. Like yeah. I, ain't, I don't even want to go into his. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> he be thinking the nigga trying to disrespect him and all this. Like it, shit, he can come play me his shit. I just I ain't never heard the music, but I tapped into it, like. What he got going when he brought uh, Sean Cotton to his house and shit, I tapped into his shit though. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. Now, shit, would you work with some of these older artists? Do you want to work with any older artists? Yep. Like, how, like, what you mean? Like, it, how, oh, any like, older artists in Dallas? Like, yeah. oh, any old yeah, nigga? Like, yeah. who, like, who you want to fuck with? The Row, uh, Young Nation, uh, like, I don't even just count Freddy as an older nigga, older nigga, like, you know I'm saying, saying, like, just a. Y'all like new generation, yeah. Dallas rap. So you talking about like a nigga, that, a nigga that had moved, that that, that, yeah. that, that made that mark. Uh, Young Nation, The Row, Freddie. Um, Lil Runny, Mother F for sure. I yeah. want a song with him. Uh, Sauce Walker, I'm giving his flower. Talking about Texas or just Dallas? Yeah, Texas. Sauce Walker. Uh, that's about it, shit. I ain't just, you know what I'm saying? Nah, for sure, for sure. Now, shit, I did see you was on a cypher with Lil Ronnie, though. Yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Shit, how you think you held up on that hoe? Shit, I held up on that bitch. Oh, God, I thought I kind of one of the toughest on that hoe. Yeah. Oh, God, niggas was tough on that hoe, though. But shit, I held up on that hoe. I did my thing, for sure. Shout out to everybody that was on that hoe. Shout out to A-Tony, Lil Ronnie. Yeah. yeah. All the rest of the cypher class. Nah, for sure, for sure. Now, bro, you, you do show a lot of love out here to the local artists. like, uh -huh. And you been like that, though. Yeah. Like, if you go back to the first interview, man, shit, she'll shout out everybody, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, like, moving forward, like, what you what you, what you want from the city, bro? I just want unity, bro, and, and everybody that know, like, I be, I be paying attention to this shit, bro. Like, it's some real money in this shit. Like, it's some real money in this shit. So I just feel like if niggas could come together and get on the same page to where we all can get on the same, you know what I'm saying, same accord. And, you know what I'm saying, get some structure and get a foundation and see how this shit supposed to go then, you know what I'm saying, we can really make some money, make some money out of this bitch. That's what, this, you know what, I'm saying? That's what everybody trying to do, you know what I'm saying. That's what bring niggas together anyways. So, yeah, I'm going to show love where, I'm going to get my flowers where, you know, where it's due, for shit show. Yeah, 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 not shit, bro. Uh, tell the people where they can follow and find you at. Uh, Instagram at YCN Barrio, Twitter at YCN Barrio. My new YouTube, subscribe, YSN Barrio. Shit, that shit, bro. And what you got What you got coming next? We push it clocked in. I got new singles on the way, videos on the way, Money Young EP on the way, features. Just shit, new shit, new paper, new me shit. That yeah. shit. Man, we in the 12-hour studio lock in tomorrow. You pulling up? I'm pulling up. That shit, so. All right.